baila porque quiero olvidar. Ponle reggaeton para que la vea sudar. Another one on the list today, guys. It is Las de la Intuición, if I pronounce it well. A big one from the 2000s from her album Fijación Oral. Las de la Intuición is a synth pop and Euro house song whose lyrics are about female intuition. What a difficult words to pronounce. <laughs> oh my god. It received mostly positive reviews from music critics who praised its lyrical content and production. That's the thing, guys. Some of you commented in the previous videos that I'm not doing the original video or the, the live performance, but I want to know the story by listening the lyrics and the live performance and the official audio and let's hear this one guys last latin to say hey there don't know shaki with a different style different hairstyle cool i like it wow we're already in the 2005 vibes right which year is the song 2005 i don't know Sorry for interrupting, but this here's a list. It's like 15 different songs, and we will work the entire list. So no worries, guys. We will do everything. So it's only Shakira now on the channel, I guess. I know it guys, I know it. It was somewhere in my brain, but I don't Love this style of her, really nice. Also, the production sounds fabulous, flawless. Wow. Wow, that was a surprise at the end. You really need to warm up with this track. Hmm. 
Okay, people, let's break down the song. I love the 2000s vibe, like, immediately. Okay, I will reveal that this song has something personal to me. I remember well when I was little that we went on holiday by car and that a lot of well-known songs between 2005 until 2010 passed by, including this one. So I immediately think of those days back in 2008 where we had to drive for hours in the dark, but never thought about it being a Spanish song. I never paid attention. Is there also an English version? Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Yeah, music video not very special. Didn't get it either, but it was interesting style that I haven't seen of her yet. But tell me your opinion about the music video. I didn't quite understand it. But the thing I admire really about Shakira is that she remains modest and she doesn't show off things and should also inspire other artists. And yeah, vocally, it sounds excellent again. And especially the last minute caught my eye. That slower, dreamy fade out, that slower, dreaming ending. And it also fits the chorus. We hear different tones of Shakira's voice through different microphones or just different filters. And that's fair, guys. I mean, a voice is also an instrument that can be played with, right? Okay, I can give one critical thing about the song, and that's between the chorus. It was in the verse. Very slow, like, hmm, we're already in the middle of the song, and it feels like we are still in the first 10 seconds. But yeah, after all, would I listen to this song again? Yes. Will this be in my Shakira personal top 10? I think so. Interesting Shakira journey so far. And I wonder what the songs have meant for her, for herself. But I guess we can never ask. We won't know. Yeah, guys, thank you for watching and subscribing. Rating for the song is going to be 9 out of 10. See you later, guys. And whoa, my microphone fell off. Well, oh, whatever. Okay, ciao, guys. See you later. Bye, bye, bye.